Hello, my name is Navigator, and in today's video I wanted to go over what I got in the Atomic Shop this week. Now, I know the first question on your minds is, Navigator, what the fuck are you wearing, dog? And uh, honestly, I'm asking myself the same thing, but this is in relation to today's video because these items are available for free um, in the Atomic Shop today. Now, the haircut itself, the Sparks Plug haircut, is for Fallout First members only, if my memory serves me right, but the, uh, the pink pantsuit that I'm wearing should be available for everybody today. So, let's uh, head inside and I can go over what I actually purchased today in the Atomic Shop. So, first up here, we have the Captain Cosmos bed. Now, before I really kind of go into this, I bought the Invaders from Beyond bundle, and this is not a new bundle. This is nothing new, but there were some stuff in the bundle that I kind of wanted myself. Um, there was one item in specifics that I really wanted that I haven't seen in a while, and I was glad to get it, and uh, I'll show that off in a second. But anyways, this is the Captain Cosmos bed. I like how it looks. It'd be nice for a more modern kind of camp build, or, I don't know, really anything. Maybe it's, it's more of a joke bed, I feel like. It reminds me of, like, those little race car bed you had when you were a kid, but I'll hop in this real quick, and you can kind of see what it looks like. Just like any other bed, it's the same animation, you're putting your head down, you know, right there, so at least I kind of have a pillow on this, although my hand kind of meshes into it. I don't know. I didn't buy the bundle for this, I prefer the cryogenic bed, uh, I prefer a lot of beds over this one, actually, but yeah, that was just one of them. So, the, uh, the next thing I got, and I'll come over here to this weapons workbench, uh, that was included in the bundle is um, the untarnished, I think it's the... Let's find out. The Untarnished Paint and Blaster. This is really cool. It's kind of like a blue chrome color as opposed to the uh, light blue red of uh, its counterpart. It's just really shiny. I kind of like it a lot. Um, honestly, I'm not sure if it's supposed to look like this, I guess, you know, out of the factory and then over time it wears down into that, but I don't know. This is uh, Fire Lance, though. This is my Alien Blaster, and I'm going to equip this paint on there. And then uh, let's bring this out, and I'll show you what it looks like uh, in hand. So... Where is Fire Lance? Here we are. Yeah, so there we go. I like this color a lot better. I do not have uh, any any skins for my Alien Blaster pistol. Um, I never really knew there were any. So this is kind of great to have. I love the Alien Blaster, though. Um, especially if you have a really good trigger finger. I don't know if you can hear me IRL spamming that. But yeah, if you have a good trigger finger, you can really make this thing almost like an automatic weapon. Anyways, let's get to the uh, second to last thing, and that would be the Captain Cosmos outfit. Um, this outfit I actually purchased beforehand, so I had a little bit of, uh, you know, price off on the um, the bundle, and it was also 25% off today. Um, but yeah, so I only got it for around 700 atoms because I'd already had this outfit. But this is the Captain Cosmos outfit. It's pretty cool. Um, I prefer the purple version. I don't have the purple version. Um, it comes in a bundle with a bunch of them, and honestly, I always thought it was really expensive. But this is a pretty sweet outfit. I love the... Uh, the helmet itself, but honestly, when you take it off, if I put on my usual kind of stuff here, you'll see, I, I kind of like how it looks without the helmet. I like the boots, the kind of brown boots, um, but yeah, in different colors, it looks a bit better, but orange, honestly, is not bad. So, let's uh, run in here, and I can give you the rundown on my last and most favorite item, and stairs here, so if you don't mind me taking some time, this is going to be the satellite dish. Now, I've always wanted this for this camp specifically. I have a, um, a siren over there. You probably really can't see it that well. But I have a siren, and, uh, you know, I got, like, little radio stuff. Um, and I figured that a satellite dish would be really cool just to kind of have on my base. But what I wasn't expecting was when I place this down, if you come over here, you can actually turn this on. I know I don't have my HUD on, but it does just say scan. It says press A for scan. So press A on there. And it'll kind of hover around like that. It makes a little noise. Let's see if you can hear it. So, yeah, I don't know if you heard that or not. It just makes a little humming noise. Um, the animation itself is probably around like five, six, seven seconds long. I'll do it again for you guys, just, just so you can see. But it, you see, it moves around. It kind of rotates. I don't know the word. But uh, this is pretty sweet. I love this. Um, I think it looks great. A little bit better, but kind of from the front here, I just love having that satellite dish there. Sorry, satellite dish there. I needed something um, on top of this roof. I was feeling this, this like this roof was a little dull. Um, but yeah, that's uh, that's what I decided to put there, and I'm very happy with it. So um, the last thing I got in the bundle, which honestly I'm really surprised about, I want to save for another video because, um, well, I guess you have to wait for that other video to find out. But this is the last thing I got, and this is the invader. Um, 
At first, I thought it was a skin for a weapon, but I actually found out something more interesting on it. So, if you're... <laughs> sorry, I found out something more interesting on it. I'm sorry I talk so fast sometimes. I just get a little excited. But, finding out what this is, the invader here, I mean, it's kind of a funny name for a little alien probe. But, um, but yeah. If you're interested in that, I should have a video coming out on it soon. But, regardless, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, the Atomic Shop this week, um, nothing really new, per se. Um... Just a lot of old stuff. They're trying to, you know, get everything out, make sure that everybody picks up what they want. Uh, before the pit drops, then they really don't have to fill the atomic shop with that garbage anymore. Um, but yeah, not a bad week. Picked up some stuff. I'm really happy about that satellite dish. That really kind of made my day. Um, and yeah, some cool free items as well. So, won't waste any more of your time, but thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. I'm very close to 500 subscribers. Once I hit 500, um, I can start using community posts, and I can, uh, you know, talk to you guys a little bit more, maybe uh, communicate some of my problems, you know, content problems to you guys, and uh, get suggestions from you guys as well. So, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day, and take care. Navigator out.